first one that strikes me is the, the failure to provide a proper ending. I definitely think that uh, it's important to, to end something properly, to take it somewhere new, to do something different. It could be as simple as a change of pace, or a change of perspective, or a change of, um, or a revelation, or an epiphany, but I think you've got to have something um, to mark the ending and too often stories just sort of rumble to a halt. The writer Conrad Williams has a theory that all first paragraphs should be jettisoned. Get rid of your first paragraph, see what you can do to save any information from that first paragraph that absolutely has to be saved and stick it somewhere else in the story. bore the reader. The reader's not involved, the reader's not interested, the reader doesn't care, or the reader doesn't believe. Um, I think that's the worst thing, the reader doesn't believe. And if the reader doesn't believe, therefore the reader doesn't care, so why should the reader bother reading? People who teach creative writing, which I do, often go on about this um, this uh, golden rule which is that you must show and not tell and it's funny it took me years to actually understand the difference between showing and telling and I think I do now and I encounter a lot of uh, a lot of writers who insist on telling um, rather than showing and now that I know exactly what it is and what the difference is between showing and telling Whenever I see telling now, it, it absolutely sticks out and, uh, and needs to be taken out and needs to be replaced by um, a scene, um, a piece of dialogue, an exchange that shows us the same thing rather than telling us that. I love using the present tense, but that doesn't necessarily mean I would always want to use it or I would always use it at the expense of another tense. And it's amazing the number of people who subscribe to that, that conventional view that you shouldn't use the present tense. Um, if you use it well, it can be incredibly useful um, and effective. No, um, I'd never say never because there are various tricks or gimmicks that you might try and they might not work, um, in which case don't do it. If you can't make it work, don't do it, but if you can make it work, you can, if you can pull off the trick, then do it, whatever the trick is. Um, it's the difference between being a, a good writer and not such a good writer. Uh, the good writer perhaps can can make something work that in a less skilled writer's hands feels like a gimmick.